Have you ever wondered why when you've had more than six months of low back pain and you've seen at least three other doctors or therapists and you've definitely had a lot of soft tissue work, a lot of massage, a lot of whatever other manipulation that practitioners wanna do, your pain relief never lasts more than a few days? Well, there's a very specific reason for that. And I'm gonna show you on our little mock patient right over here. This is Dr. Nicholas. He graduated from chiropractic school about six months ago. And he's had chronic low back pain as he's going through chiropractic school that no amount of soft tissue work to his entire low back muscles helped him. And since we've been treating him here at the clinic, he's 80% better in his chronic low back pain. The reason why so many people with chronic low back pain don't get relief is because practitioners are missing the needle in the haystack for where their problem is. So again, we're gonna look at Dr. Nicholas's low back. His ribs are above this line. His pelvis is below this line. He doesn't have any more low back muscles to the left of this line. And this is his spine right in the middle. If I were to go and massage all this area, he'll feel great for a few days, but then the pain will come right back. But what I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna look for the most common cause of chronic pain that almost no doctors or therapists are talking about. And I'm gonna show you the one or two spots that he has it, and it's only in those spots, not in his entire low back. Dr. Nicholas, go ahead and crunch your belly up. And now I'm gonna feel the entire surface area of his muscles to see where he has adhesion. He's got one spot right here that's about the size of a marble. That's tender, right? He's got a knot right there that is noticeably tender to him. He's got another big golf ball size spot right here. So this spot here is number one. This spot here is number two. He's got knots right up here. Now, if he goes into a massage therapist and they feel these knots, they're gonna push on him. He's gonna say, oh, that's the spot. He'll feel great for a few days. The symptoms will come right back. We don't treat, treat knots in this office. We only treat adhesion. So when, as we've been treating him, he had a lot more of these circles for the past few months and we've removed them. The last two spots of adhesion that are sticking him up are right in this spot. So as we treat him and we release this, things get better. And I'm gonna do a couple of treatment passes on those spots right now. Go ahead and relax your butt really down. So right now I'm on the adhesion, and right now I'm stretching it as much as I possibly can without sliding on the skin. And then he's gonna crunch his belly and start stretching it. And now I can feel the adhesion tearing underneath my skin his skin. Good. Relax down. And usually the patient can feel the tissue being stretched. Crunch up. It's tearing. It's tearing. Can you feel it stretching, Nicholas? And he can feel it tearing. Good. If you've had chronic low back pain for a while and you're sick and tired of temporary relief, ask your practitioner or find a practitioner who can localize the one, two, or three pieces of adhesion that are probably about this big or this thick, it's not often thicker than that, that's causing your chronic pain. And the best part about this is when you get those spots treated and torn off, you will have permanent relief in one to five visits. And then if you decide to continue to the average case of 12 treatments, you're gonna be 50, 75, 100% better. So you no longer have to flush time or money or energy down the toilet because now you know that you need to find the few spots that are causing your pain. This is a piece of steak, also known as a muscle. Normal, healthy muscle is just the steak. Adhesion is like glue inside of it. It's a wad of gum. And when I push down on the tissue with my fingers, I'm trying to feel, is it a raw steak? Is it soft? Can I get into it? When I push down over the adhesion, I can't get as far. It feels like a well done steak. That's how I know the adhesion's there. Then when I take my finger and go into it and I try to stretch it, it will be pushing back against my finger. And that's how I know that there's adhesion there. Knots do not do that. 
healthy muscle does not do that. So what we do at Barefoot Rehab is find where these pieces of glue or adhesion are and we strip them and tear them out. And it's only by gradually chipping away at this adhesion and tearing it out until it's gone is now the muscle is healthy, the steak is healthy, and then when I push back into that muscle tissue, I'm gonna be able to get as far down as I could in the other healthy muscle there because that adhesion is completely gone.